Hello everyone, welcome back to another tutorial. In today's tutorial, I am going to make the inventory system or the UI and in the next tutorial, we're going to script the inventory. So, with that being said, please join the Discord down in the description, uh, subscribe and like this video and let's jump straight into it. So this inventory is going to be completely inspired by Sol's RNG. Is inventory so great so we're going to make a screen UI inside of the stock UI so we're going to say inventory we're going to put a frame inside of here set the anchor point to 0.5.5 0.5.5 uh, set the position and the size to scale set the position to 0.5.5 oh, 0.5.5 there we go scale it up a bit something like this maybe uh, nope we need to make it bigger there we go I think this looks great remove uh, sorry change the name of the frame to background <laughs> change the background color to a dark change the background transparency to 0.6 maybe uh, set a UI corner to 0 0.04 maybe nope 0 0.02 looks better uh, so you can customize this however you want. I will follow along with the tutorial UI that Sol's RNG has, but you can make your own if you know how to do that. Uh, UI stroke, uh, make it three maybe. I'm gonna make it white. Perfect. Set the background to 0.5.5 on the position. Great. We can copy the background. We can put it inside of background, rename this to info frame. Uh, and we can put it to the side here. Something like this maybe. Perfect. Inside of the info frame, <laughs> we can duplicate the info frame, put it inside of info frame. Uh, we can rename this to title background we can expand this box a bit something like this perfect i think that looks great uh, we can make the corners a little bit better i think so point three instead point three and point yeah perfect inside of the tackle title background sorry we can make a text label called label anchor point to point 5.5 scale it on both position and size set the position to the center make this a little bit smaller perfect there we go. Uh, background tra transparency to one. Going to center this 0.5.5. I'm going to set the text scale to true. I'm gonna change the font to highway gothic. Change the text to a white one. Can rename this to epic, and I can change the color just for the video. Perfect. So this, we can also make the title background a little bit uh, darker, so we can say 0 0.4, 0 0.2 instead. Perfect. Now, we can duplicate the info frame, put it inside of the info frame again. We can remove the title background. We can also remove UI stroke and the UI corner. We can put it down here. Something like this maybe. 
Hmm. Here we go. I think that looks great. Here we go. Uh, change the background transparency to one. Change the name of this to list uh, frame. Inside of the list frame, we're gonna say put the UI list layout. We're going to do. We can duplicate the list frame. No, we cannot. Sorry. We can uh, add a text button. We can convert the size to scale. We are going to scale this to this size. Set the UI corner to it. Point fifteen, maybe. Nope. Point three. That looks great. Change the button text to nothing. I'm going to change the background color to this one. And I'm also going to... Uh -uh, what? Okay. We can just take the, uh, the color of the info frame. Set it to a list frame. Perfect. Set the... Oh, sorry. To the text button. Set the background transparency to 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.4, 0 0.3, 0 0.2. And we can add a UI stroke to it. And we can set it to a white one. Or let me see. Yeah, so duplicate them three times. The first one is the rarity label so this uh, uh, so we can say selectable no we could make this a frame but it's a bit tricky so just change the padding to maybe 0 0.2 nope 0 0.0 Zero 0.5 zero point zero 0.07 looks better <laughs> change the uh, UI stroke here to border there we go this would be the equip button uh, set it to border make this a green one <laughs> and same here it shall be a red one because it's on the equip. Change it to border and uh, remove button. There we go. So, if we go ahead and put a, we can uh, duplicate the label, put it inside of remove button, uh, make it bigger, say remove, make it red. Duplicate it, put it inside of equip button, say equip, and make this green. There we go. And we can also duplicate it one more time, put it in inside of rarity, make this text white, and say one in, we can say eight. Perfect. That looks great in my opinion. Uh, so we're done with that one <laughs> so we can duplicate the info frame put it inside of the background oh it's already inside sorry we can say or uh, 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 let me see container background remove the list frame remove the title background change the position to 0.5 there we go we can expand it a bit so i will not make the special aura uh, so you know here we go it looks pretty good i think we can expand it a bit more there we go something like that so, we are going to, inside of the container background, 
we're going to put a let me see we can put a we can put the scrolly UI in here scrolly frame sorry center it center it here as well 0 0.5 0 0.5 scale it set it here here oh I'm just gonna expand it so it covers this something like that maybe can make it a little bit bigger there we go looks great if we set the background color to a darker one change the transparency to point two change this scrolling frame uh, to uh, camera position uh, oh sorry my bad uh, the camera size here we can change this to 0. Point, no sorry point 0.8 nope 1 okay I'm gonna revert changes sorry guys <laughs> so we're going to change the thickness to maybe 5 make it white uh, okay perfect I'm going to set a UI corner into uh, this one 0 0.03 maybe perfect it does not work okay so instead of doing that we just gotta copy the container background make another background almost a, as big there we go something like this we're going to make this a lot darker to change the transparency 4.4 and now we're going to uh, change this to second container background and inside of here we're going to add the scrolling frame so if we go ahead and anchor it scale it and set the position to 0.5.5 expand it a little bit more okay where in the fucking hell is the center so I'm gonna center it here we go I'm gonna set the background transparency to 1 we're going to change the thickness to 6. I'm going to make it white. Perfect. It looks much greater. <laughs> so. We can rename this to container. Perfect. Okay. So I think. We can also make a template. Uh, so. We're going to add a text button. We're going to scale the size sorry we do not need to do that we can add a UI grid layout we can add a text button we can change the cell size to can we scale it maybe nope we cannot okay so we can change the size to 0 0 0.02 0 0.04 0 0.1 0 0.2 maybe 0 0.115 so here you have to experiment so offset to 0 and scale to 0 0.02 okay 0 0.1 68 64 we need to add on the X okay there we go does 
look a little bit better. We can add a UI corner to this. 7.15. Perfect. If we remove the text inside of here, uh, we can change the background transparency to this that we already have here. But add the transparency to 0. Point. Oof, we do not need to have a transparency there. We can add a UI stroke to it. If it does not look way too fucked. It does. So we can fix that by going into the container. And set the... Uh -uh -uh. Nope. Or is it? Yeah, it is. Alright. Uh, 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 let me see, let me see. I don't really remember. Okay, so we will fix it in the next episode. Uh, so it will look, not look this fucked up. I will try to find out how to do it. So change the offset to 0 0.2, nope, 0 0.05, uh, 0 0.03, no, 0 0.05, and the, on the y-axis to 0 0.02. We can maybe change this to center. Yeah, looks better. Uh, we're gonna fix this in the next episode. So this is the template currently. So we can we can just set it to the center for now. Nope, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna kill myself. Okay, what am I doing? <laughs> okay. So the last thing we're gonna do is add a text label inside of here. So I'm gonna position it. I'm going to set the anchor point to zero. There we go. Scale it. Uh, scale it down here and here and here. A little bit smaller. There we go. Okay, something like that. Background transparency to one. Uh, text scale. Set this to same as the epic one just for now and change the font to highway gothic and i can change the text to epic okay perfect i think that is everything for today's video so this is the template we're gonna we can see how it looks so it will look something like this you can change it later on, equip it, remove. Perfect. We can also. We're not done, sorry. We can change the text. We can add a text label inside of the background. We can copy this we already have inside of here. Put it inside of the background. Put it here. Say. Normal auras, or we can just say auras. Uh, four out of six for now. Make it white. There we go. Perfect. So I think this is great. Uh, yeah. So, with that being said, please consider subscribing. We will fix this issue in the next episode and. Yeah, so I'll see you in the next uh, video. Goodbye.